What's up, my dudes and dudettes? Today we are back for another episode of Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We are here with our Linky boy. Look at him. He is so handsome. We love him. He's great. I have bad news to report. Game Grumps did, in fact, beat me. It wasn't much of a shock. They can afford to put out videos faster than I can. I gotta work all the time, so sometimes it's hard to get stuff recorded. And also, I don't have a team of editors like they do, so I have to edit everything by hand, and unfortunately, that can be a little time-consuming because it takes me so long to take an hour-long video and compress it down into even like 30 minutes. That's a lot of cutting and I don't think a lot of people realize just how much effort goes into that. So today we're gonna prep for Genon. I'll never forget though the one time that Mark had a dream because Mark has a habit of talking in his sleep and he just shot up one night. He was like, I'm a chicken in the air fryer. Honey, honey, wh what are you talking about? You don't understand me. And then just goes right back to sleep like nothing happened. And when I confront him, well, you must be making things so far up. That never happened. Dude, it, it did. All right, let's go to Pura. Anything about the fifth sage? Yep, Minaru. And we got, yep, sage of spirit. Minaru, yep. So now I want to collect some Gibdo boons. I want to collect some Gibdo boons. And you will see why once we snipe Ganon. Get him where it hurts. Cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bash his nuts until he's like mashed potatoes. I'm gonna mash his potatoes. I mean, could fondle him. I mean, could touch him. You know what I mean? Like, I wanna kiss- I wanna kiss Ganondorf. I wanna kill Ganondorf. No, I'm gonna kiss him. Maybe a little smooch, too. I'm just teasing, of course. Because in case Mark watches this, he's gonna be like, Are you actually serious? You would give me the- No, obviously I'm fucking around. It's like, chill your cello there, dear. Chill your cello. Relax. Put some perm on your attitude. Woo! Cause you gotta relax. That was bad. That was so bad. My my voice is shot to high hell because of the season. It's just making me so stuffy and sniffly because it's so cold out. And I'm like, ooh, that's that's lovely. Thank you. Thank you, Tennessee. Where are we gonna find some gib Hmm, we already got some from like over here. Hey, Bloopy. Hey, Bloops. Nope. All right. You know, we might want to actually like cover, cover our nipples. Cover our spicy nips for some reason, man, nipples are fine. I'm playing Pokemon, the new DLC dropped. And I've been playing that, and I gotta admit, it's harder than the last one. The Kitakami one, Teal Mask, that one was actually fairly easy. This new one, they employ big boy strats, Pokemon Championship IRL strats. And I'm like, oh, fuck. You mean they're not just gonna be simpletons I can exert my will upon? That's lame. I don't want my fragile little ego to be disrupted. I've actually been working on like a little... FNAF fan comic? I'm really excited about it. It's about Circus Baby. And I know people are gonna be like, it's such an overrated character, but like, I thought it'd be cool. I wish that the ch child victims would get expand upon more as characters and not just be faceless entities that don't have like a voice or any sort of identity. And that's what I thought was so good about the FNAF VHSs was because they actually explored the horror of being a kid trapped in one of those things, you know? I'm doing my part. If you saw the last video, you know. Shut up. I eat pieces of shit like you for breakfast. You eat pieces of shit? <laughs> Jump in the hole. There's a hole in the desert. Can only be filled by you. I can't even remember what band that is. Extreme? I'm gonna look like a dumbass in the comments. I just know. Oh, we're in a hidey hole. Sexy. I want Gibby. <laughs> Gibby. <you. laughs> I love you. Kiss me on my hot mouth. I'm feeling romantical. Tulane, get the fuck out of my way. How we feeling? How we feeling, boys? How we how we feeling, fellas? I'm not gonna look a bomb near bomb fuck. <coughs> I'm not gonna look a bomb arrow in the mouth. It's not very polite of me to do, you know. Why bother? It's unimportant. Why the fuck did I waste time on that? This happened to me lots before. Blow myself up when I shoot at the door. Weezer. Oh, oh, oh! You're you're lovely. Well, hello. You know, but you might want to give me like a little bit of warning. That was impressive, though, how I managed to blow myself up. Reinventing the wheel to blow the fuck up out of myself. Snipe. 
360 no scope. You know, I, I love this part of the game where we just we get ready to no scope Ganon. Where we're we're gonna fuck him up so bad that he's gonna come crawling back to both of his his mommies, Kobume and Kotake. He's gonna be like, no, don't want my butt. Yay, there's Bolson. Bolson's in the game. Now well, the pirates are gone, even the air itself feels clean again. Truly, I can't thank you enough. The way you fought those pirates, it was incredible, all inspiring. And now that you've driven them out, it's my turn to get to work. Yes, the pirates may be gone, but that doesn't mean we can't roll out the welcome wagon yet. Or welcome- I'm just reading words that aren't there. <laughs> we have to do something about the state of the village or no one will return. My name is Cleveland Brown. <laughs> Don't worry. I might not look it, but I know a thing or two about construction. I know I'm a queen, and I know, like, girl. That top is doing you no favors. Besides, I owe you. No, I owe this entire village for taking me in. And also, I want to say thank you for the gay bar. That's been great for me. It's been lovely. And I pay my debts. It's kind of my thing. Also, this village has charm. I can't wait to restore the restaurant and the lucky treasure shop to their former glory. Hmm, materials might be an issue, though. See, I'm going to need a rather large amount of logs and Hylian rice. And since I want to use the palm trees, the central pillars in the village, the logs are going to have to come from somewhere else. Hello, it's my favorite twig. <laughs> Yeah, baby! That's what I've been waiting for! That's what it's all about! Woo! Why do you say? No, I appreciate the offer, but you already done so much. You drove off all those awful pirates after all. I couldn't ask an outsider to go do so, some fuck. Now, no. If he's offering to help, who are we to say no? As of today, you and me are pals. And because we're pals, I'm gonna let you help me. Now that that's decided, I'm gonna go briefly over everything on our to-do list. First, we're gonna rebuild each destroyed building foundation. So let's see. Yeah? I think you can collect 15 logs for me. I think you can bring me a log later. That's all we need! And when I say logs, I don't mean ones from palm trees. That's so passe. We don't do that. I'm gonna use those palm trees or something important, so get those logs from the trees, okay? And then I can get the log off your tree, if you know what I mean. Also, I'm gonna need 20 bundles of Hylian rice to repair the thatched roofs that were burned. You know, we're going for like a cottage core kind of like summer kind of moment. You know what I mean? Like it's giving, it's giving beach house. I like that. Think you can handle that too? That's a loaded question right there, Balson. Thank you for everything. I won't be able to assist you myself. I'll be looking around and assessing the damage. I'm gonna call this project the Great Lurland Village Revival. Our first collaboration. How exciting is that? <laughs> no pressure or anything, but I'll be counting on you. Dude. I mean, we, we love a, a campy gay construction worker. We love that. We love that on this channel. Okay, you know what? We're not gonna do this quest. It's gonna take a long fucking time. And frankly, I don't feel like doing that. We're just gonna do some side quests just to do little funky shit. Um, look at all the lonely sheep dogs. Da, 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 da. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hi, hi, pal. Hi. Hey, can I? Can, oh, yes. Could I give you a kiss? Can I give, give peace kiss? Give peace give kiss? Yes. Hey, hi. Hello, buddy. Hi. What's you doing? Oh my god, you're such a good boy. You're such a good boy. Yes. Ah. Uh, <laughs> doggy. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Oh, here's pen 15. What the fuck is down here? Oh, it's li Lizals. These little fuckers. Fuck you. I hope you choke on your dad. Come on, you want some? They go low, I go lower. They don't know who they're messing with. They just- I'm too damn crazy for them. Fucker. Oh, you- you absolute dickbag. Okay. Cool. Let me get my shield back, you dweeb. Mama didn't raise no bitch. Okay, just kidding. Maybe mama raised a bitch. Oh, you scared me, Minoru. I thought like a construct big ass god was be like, <gasps> supposed to be like, no, not my Puaguas. 
You about to die? Ooh, -woo. that actually wasn't too hard. Now we're gonna get a bonus heart from I Man. By the way, lately we saw the movie Family Switch on Netflix. The reason why I wanted to watch it was because there's a Weezer cameo. Because of course, I swear it was written by people who've never had a funny thought in their life. It was a comedy, but it was so fucking awful. It was just poop jokes, fart jokes, and it just was not funny at all. The CGI was like Son of the Mask tier. It was awful. It was so bad. And quite frankly, I don't know how that got through, but then again, it's Netflix, and Netflix movies don't have the best track record. They kind of suck. But hey, Weezer was pretty pretty kicking, you know what I'm saying? Now, of course, it's gonna be a lot of people be like, who gives a fuck about Weezer? I care, damn it. I care. Buy some shit from Robbie, because, you know, we like to support local business, especially when it's an old man that's fucking crazy. <laughs> Rob's. Rob Deerdeck, what you need from us, man? Can I buy a picture, man? Okay. Wait, which ones did I get? Fox? Tails? Tails? Watch out! You're gonna crash! Ah! Let me go to... I wanna see... Uh... Big Owl Man. I wanna see... What's this fuck? So it's fucking new. Canelli! 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 I never forgot your name for a moment, buddy! I knew- I knew it the whole time. Come on, sweetie. Get your little elf ass up there. Elf on a shelf. More like Link on a sink. More like Link when he stink. Linky, Linky, why stinky? Oh, I just remembered something. I just remembered a story. So, as you could see on my wall back there, I have a lot of paintings, correct? So, behind the TV right there, I have a painting of, like, all the Sonic characters. And my mom in the car the other day, there's a teardrop guy. And I'm like, mom, what do you mean teardrop guy? She's like, the, the teardrop guy. I'm like, context? And she's like, the teardrop guy. He's the guy, he's a teardrop head. And I'm like, what are you talking about? And she just goes on for a couple minutes. She's like, the teardrop guy, you know him. You have to know him. He's in your room. He's the teardrop guy. Do you know the teardrop guy? The teardrop guy. The teardrop guy. Ah, uh, yes, I know the teardrop guy. The one in Katya's room? She's drawing the teardrop guy. The teardrop guy? The teardrop guy! And I'm like, Mom, what on earth are you talking about? She's like, well, I just don't know. You can Google it. Google teardrop guy. Okay, so his teardrop guy. So you said, like, teardrop head. She's like, yeah. And then finally it hit me. Mom, are you talking about a chow from Sonic Adventure 2? And she's like, well, if that's what it's called. And she's like, Google it. Google it now. I need to see what it looks like. My like, mom, can it not wait? Google it now. And I, this is a teardrop Teardrop guy, I need- I'm not crazy, Katya! And it's like, you're acting a little crazy. So I pull up, she's like, that's it! That's him! That's a teardrop guy! That's what you meant the whole time. And she's like, don't mock me! Don't make fun of me! You know I was right about the teardrop guy! And I'm like, parents, man, they're funny. I still miss Teba. Man, I love you too, Lynn, but like, your dad was cooler. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna end off the episode here. If you guys liked it as always, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye! Yeah.